Around the situation at the Edo train station in Abuja, as passengers besieged the station, struggling for tickets. Some of the passengers blamed the situation on elect ticket racketeering and hoarding by officials of the Nigeria Railway Corporation. I sent somebody from my house to go and queue for me to get a ticket for Kaduna for 2 o'clock. So he said because I learned a salary period and the queue might be too long. So he came, he left here about 9, 8.30. He said they were not selling until 11.30 for 2 o'clock ticket, for 2 o'clock train. So at 11, something, we left the house. We got here about 11.30. To, to our amazement, they said tickets has been sold out. We got here very early for us to be able to purchase the ticket to Kaduna. We were only told that we should come back at 11.30. We came back at 11.30, we were told the tickets were over. We now find, have it on good authority that the staff and the police are coming together, getting the ticket and selling outside of the station. Now, in, at this station, please, you can, you can cross-check it yourself. You cannot pay by your car, with your card or using POS. It's, everything is cash and carry. No official of the Nigeria Railway Corporation will speak to our crew as they claim to be busy when contacted. Although there was heavy passenger traffic at the Namdi Azikwe International Airport, the situation was calm as the departure hall of the airport has failed to capacity. Some of the passengers also share their experience as they prepare to travel for the holiday. The airport is so busy, like a um, large crowd out here. I think everybody seems to be going for the holidays. A lot of um, persons are here for obvious reasons. For obvious reasons. Uh, it has to do with um, people fix ceremonies in festive periods like this. So that's why you have a large turnout of persons traveling. The federal government had declared Monday the 12th and Tuesday the 13th of August as public holidays to enable Muslims in Nigeria celebrate the Idil Kabir.